hello welcome back to my channel myself HD today I'm going to show you how to install the Amazon Linux AMI so first of all I'm logged into my AWS account then I go to that EC2 from here EC2 yeah then the instance I have already one instance but I create another new instance the launch instance so normally basically I use the free for the training purpose so I use the free trial and uh, I use the Amazon Linux the AMI I select that it's already free eligible tier and also it is free uh, tier eligible the next and what is the purpose of the number of instance it is the number of instance means how many instance do you need so if you need the one or more so you can type here two or three or four you can install you can check that you can launch your instance into the auto scaling also so the second thing is the request spot instance so right now I don't elaborate that topic I elaborate in my earlier video and also the network with a creative VPC or already had default VPC so we just right away we do the default and also the subnet we don't change any thing assign auto assign the public IP it's enable you can check that use subnet setting we are using as a default but we can enable disable it placement group we don't add right away I mean rule we don't create the IAM user so that's why and the shutdown behavior actually when you shut down that instance so the behavior is stop or terminate so we always I preferred the stop and protect against the accidental termination so we don't check out right now but professional server we require that enable cloud watch detail monitoring so we don't enable it okay so so many things here you can comment you can add the as a command so we go to that add storage the AWS have the 30 GB maximum pre users so we use at least 20 and also the general purpose SSD okay so delete on termination it's checked because when we delete it that the EC2 instance so it's termination encryption type not encrypted okay so add tag right away I don't uh, I don't want to add any tag but for a demo purpose we add I just add a tag it's like a AMI does basically why it is required it's required for you have so many so many so many instance so you are how to remember what instance what can do so that is only one the tag or key so you can remember that okay so next I use you can create a new it's like a, server so I use only HTTP and the MySQL MySQL or uh, and also the custom port is 21 for the FTP right away I allow from anywhere but in the present in the production server we don't enable it that like it's only enabled with our IP or custom okay so 
we review and launch so here is already a error message warning message security so I just launch I have a key like a web server so I select but if you don't have the key you can create a key like and also you download that because you have download that key private key file the p dot pm file before you can continue okay so you will not be able to download the file again after it's created so please remember and keep it safe place okay so I already have that key so that's why I launch yeah view instance it's initializing and how to check the tags you can check the tags here okay we can check that how what key uh, we are using the key name and also you can check the instance type the availability zone this instance state it's running initializing alarm it's not set for the none and also a public IP address it's like that so Yeah, it's ready if you are using a Ubuntu or any other Linux PC so you can through the connect to that command you can just 400 on that file permission set and then you can use that key with a user that is the user for the I am AI AMI server is use EC2 as user. I already talked to about in my previous video, and that is the DNS. Okay, so you can use that command where when where your that file is. Okay, so my server is ready. I can show you how to connect to that SSH for my next video and how to install that PHP MySQL and PHP MyAdmin. Okay, thank you so much. Thanks a lot. If you like my video, please subscribe and like and share. If you have any queries, you can comment out in my video. Thank you so much. Have a great day.